C88. Hello everyone and welcome back to Speak Some More. My name is Eras88 and today as you can see I'm in the middle of a cave. Uh, in between episodes I've actually been quite busy <laughs> exploring all of the uh, cave systems below our new newest vase which is the one uh, near the uh, cherry blossom forest. And yeah, uh, I was doing some mining, just you know, lighting up all that stuff and uh, gathering some of the materials, but I made a, um, quite an interesting discovery that I wanted to share with you guys, so that's why I started recording before going any further. And for that discovery to actually be um, properly uncovered, I need to get rid of all of my stuff, because yeah, there's a high, high risk of losing everything I have on me right now, which is not um, <laughs> very, uh, very good news, I think. So yeah, I'm just gonna put um, all my stuff, well, the important one, I see, uh, at least, because I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill whatever we are going to encounter, if we encounter something down there. By now I hope you are starting to get an idea of what I'm talking about. But yeah, <laughs> I'm, I'm getting nervous, not gonna lie. Um, so yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is actually to have one of these diamond swords. And I'm gonna... Um, put this on instead of the armor I have right now just in case I die I don't lose on the first try uh, the important stuff I mean fortune uh, you know what I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do this one and maybe yeah this one this one's I don't care uh, maybe I can just drop this ones here and let's place all this back on the ender chest and yeah if I die I die uh, but yeah I, I still have all of this new material that I that I have been um, gathering from the, the caves it's been quite a journey here I'm not gonna break this one just in case I want to come back. If I can come back, of course. But yeah, this is what I was talking about. This is the first time I've been near any of the new... Uh, well, not new by now, but... <laughs> oh, shit! Well, that's a great way to begin the episode. What the fuck was that? Or maybe I didn't mm, put enough. Uh, illumination. <laughs> I thought I did. Wait, or maybe it didn't? Oh, I wasn't. I, I, I hadn't even come up here yet. Huh, interesting. Maybe I did, and yeah, I, I did. I, I just didn't put any type of lights in. Huh. I'm sorry. Oh yeah, I remember now how. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember how I went down. Um, but yeah, basically this is the first time that I've been uh, near any type of block for the end city, and I'm quite nervous about it because I did want to find an, a, a, a one of those. Not, it's not an end city. How is it called? Um, oh, sh did you hear that? Did you guys hear that? Mm. 
Oh my god. Oh, that's the worst sound I could have heard. No, oh my god. <laughs> For real now. Are you telling me I'm not gonna be able to go here? Damn, no, no, no. Oh, this is so freaky. Terrifying. That was two, right? I think with the third one is where the warden appears. But I I'm not even... I'm not even near the cave! Well, of course, I think I am because of that, but... What if a warden just appears and kills me? You know what? Just... let's just go. That's the third one. I don't even know where. I'm just going, I'm just going. Oh, the sound design is so... Oh, shit! That's the warden. Freaking close, dude. I don't even want to move. <laughs> this is so freaking terrifying. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I don't think he can actually get me here. God damn it, that's so terrifying. The sound design is just like, wow. Sounds like it's near me. Why does it sound like it's near me? Sniffing. Heartbeat's going down. Freaking creepy, man. Oh, the heartbeat stopped. Okay, okay. So what I was thinking is to actually just try and find the, the opening. But now that the warden's up, I mean, it's going to be like quite difficult to get some peace of mind here. Already here? Wait, it came down. Oh, 
Yeah, it's going down. I don't know what that sound is, but it's so freaking scary, man. Okay, okay, okay. So what if I try and open it? stressful oh <gasps> there it is I found the blocks okay in case the warden comes up I'm just gonna run and wait for it to go away holy You guys saw it. <laughs> oh, did you guys saw that? <laughs> that was so freaking scary. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stay here and wait for it to go, and I'll see you. I'll see you as soon as he goes away. Oh my god, that was so freaking stressful. And I just realized that I messed up by placing those blocks again. At least I know now where it is. Yep. Let's run away. And let's wait for him to go away again. this creature so if I break that hmm. I don't know if I'm close enough to actually um, create vibrations in case I just jump. Oh. <laughs> I think it wasn't. Okay, I think I'm safe here. Okay, 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 okay. I need this thing. And I do want to get my silk touch pickaxe. Just in case. Just in Oh, it does make sound! Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna break them then. Nope! Oh, <laughs> 
<laughs> this is a nerve wracking Am I maybe too close? Oh, the sounds are so freaking creepy. I just wanted to break those uh, like redstone uh, signal launchers thingies uh, with the silk tube pickaxe just so I don't actually destroy them and we can actually use them, you know? Maybe for decoration or maybe just to use it and all that stuff. Then I think now we have to wait again. So this is a patience game. Because <laughs> what I do need to to destroy is this creature. Once this creature is gone, the 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 warden is not going to appear any longer. Okay, so next round. If I'm not wrong, I did get rid of all the important blocks, for now at least. Oh, here's this creature. Are you serious? like another 20 minutes oh jesus okay so let's see if we can do it again okay so if i'm not wrong it's supposed to be this block There we go. Should be fine, right? <laughs> right? And I'm guessing... I got the Shrieker, the Shrieker, sorry. And one Skulk sensor at least. And I do have Skulk. So I, I think I'm gonna... Um, harvest this material and just pay close attention in case I like hear any other skulk sensor oh what is this what is that skulk catalyst oh is this the one that uh, drops like um, experience points if you break it like normally I think it is right So this is just like a blob, it's not like uh, we're going to be, we're going to be able to find like a way out of here to find the trail to the city. Another catalyst, because I think I read somewhere that uh, these kind of blobs and structures and stuff start spawning like in uh, leading you to 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 where the city is that's why I wanted to find like this new skull blocks but I think this is going to be like a nice building block 
the only issue you have is the fact that uh, the mechanics of this block you know if you kill something or some experience points are dropped uh, near this block it will like uh, grow and it will extend so yeah we would have to be very careful to where we place it just so we don't like mess up everything <laughs> So yeah, this was just like a, a little blob. So maybe not not as exciting as I thought it would be. I thought maybe this would go to a, another cave and we would be able to follow the trail and find one of our friends, but in their actual home. A little bit of a disappointment there, but not to worry. We can still uh, keep... Exploring these caves and... Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> are you for real right now? Oh my god. Okay, right, right here I see one shrieker. But you know what? I'm not gonna go here like right now. I think I need to prepare quite a bit. Oh my god, this is so huge and so creepy. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna try just to go down a few blocks without, well, trying not to disturb anything down there. Just to get a glimpse of what's on the other side. Oh, this is so stressful. <laughs> massive there's one shrieker there there's another shrieker there there's another one down there I don't know if you guys can see it but yeah there's another one down there so the mission here is actually to get rid of all of the shriekers and then we can kinda um, explore the whole city I do like the fact that there's like um, lava and water over there which means there's maybe an exit again there's like stuff down here I could just go down and fly well not right now because I don't have my light drone but but yeah I could just like go down and fly but I do want to explore this like it was intended to so I'm gonna grab some wool I'm gonna go back here and I'm gonna just go with it but I'm guessing that's going to be done for next episode guys so yeah uh, I think this is where I stop uh, this episode today I really hope you guys are enjoying <laughs> I'm quite terrified <laughs> and if you are please consider leaving a like and maybe subscribing to my channel and I'll see you in the next episode see ya